talking with Ken Betterton. And it's in your power principles. Motivate yourself first because those around you are going to share in that energy. We keep waiting for someone to motivate us. Talk about motive because I know how you take motivation. You break it into two words too. Yeah, and you break the word down. It's called motive for action. Supply a motive for action. When we look at it, it's another one of those things that, like we talked about earlier, Charlie, everywhere I go, the opportunities that I have to, in, to be involved and work with other people, there's questions that I get, and the number one question that I always get is, Kenny, how do I motivate them? Yeah. And it hasn't changed. I mean, yeah. 1995 or 2012 is how do I motivate them? It's like, give me this magic wand. Yeah. Uh, you know, it really and truly, it's, it's getting to the point where I just want to be direct and say, Tomorrow morning when you get up, look in the mirror, give yourself the Kenny test, scale of one to ten, one I'm not, ten I'm off the chart, how motivated you are you? And if you're not motivated, give me a call, we'll take care of it. It's, it life is pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. It, they set the tone. The the leaders, the managers, the, the, the people out there trying to get the motivation up, it starts with them. They control the environment. If they're passionate and they're motivated, guess what? The people around there are going to be passionate and motivated. It's hard for me to come into the to the building when it's not motivated, yeah. and then pick myself up. But really and truly, regardless, I mean, I, I I work for myself now. I don't have anybody. To motivate. Well, sometimes the people out there motivate me, but I, I got to stay upbeat. I got to motivate myself, and and uh, you know, hopefully have something out there to give them in return. If you're having trouble with that one, just leave a note under this video. We'll get you in touch with it.